right there look at the beautiful eight lane highway of Hyderabad city of Telangana state India beloved friends when I see these beautiful surroundings around it beautiful plantation vegetation the flowering trees they inspire us and I remember the robot first home woods are lovely dark and deep but I have promises to keep and miles to go before I sleep and miles to go before I sleep dear friends we are on a very short journey of life but the life has to be really a very exciting one a very very realistic life tell me not in a mournful number life is but an empty dream the soul is dead that slumbers and things are not as they seem life is real life is earnest and the grave is not his goal dust thou art to dust returneth was not spoken by the soul in this world broad field of battle in this world broad field of battle in the bivouac of life be not a dumb driven cattle be a hero in this strife lives of great men all remind us we can make our lives sublime and departing leave behind us footprints of the sands of time from this poem of psalm of life i derive the inspiration for myself and for millions all around the world that our life is very precious stephen hawking said there is only one life we cannot be born again of course lot of religion suggests that we will be born again but not at all so let's work very hard with dedication commitment and passion and not being a conformist rather being very adventurous taking challenges thinking those novel thoughts which nobody dreamed nobody thought that's why we have conquered time and space that should be the real motive with all his sham tragedy and broken dreams it is still a beautiful world so let me be cheerful and strive to be happy by engaging ourselves in trying to understand better ideas to discover new inventions and make the earth a better place and nothing better than this let's make the world a peaceful place all are living in harmony there is no anger there is no hatred there is no jealousy there is no cynical thoughts but all are wise they cooperate they help each other they cooperate with each other they try to see that all are happy not only humans but birds Beloved friends, in that context, wonderful stanza from again Robert Frost. Two roads diverge in a yellow, and sorry, I couldn't travel both. And being one traveler, long I stood and looked on one as far as I could. Where it bent in the undergrowth, then took the other, just as just and as fair. Beloved friends, in this poem it has been suggested that we should not be afraid of taking a more difficult and more challenging path. I shall be telling this with a sigh. So 
somewhere ages and ages hence two roads diverge in a wood and I I took the ones less travelled by and that has made all the difference let's come out from the comfort zone we should not try to be escaping from challenges adversities misfortune obstacles and reverses because never change is the better way curse or regret do we whimper and whine but then must be met and those who fight a good fight though the ventures in vain shall have many a victory to pay for his claim so when we are meeting diverse adversities and misfortune did this that god has planned it nature is testing us and we should really do some wonderful things for us never allow mind to be empty otherwise some kind of discouragement will come fear and doubt will come that will spoil our belief faith courage conviction motivation inspiration and charisma keep on doing some noble things keep the company of the best people also so that they will also inspire us and always we shall be having a positive mind directed towards a definite purpose a tremendous belief and capacity for life faith with self control self discipline creative imagination and control attention budgeting time money energy learning from our defeats and failures maintaining a sound physical health also enjoying physical mental spiritual emotional balance that's the way we can live happily let's not forget that wonderful poem of Ralph Waldo Emerson hence for please god for if i have forsaken the yoke of men's opinion i shall be like a bird and here the god's words always listening to our own conscience out of others and breathe easy happy life peaceful life joyful life thank you friends for watching this video be happy in the state of mind be energetic and enthusiastic be with always a wise 